One day, I saw this owl, and then this happened. Let's play that again in slow motion. This behavior is known as mobbing. It's when a smaller bird chases or dive bombs a larger bird. It's common to see red-winged blackbirds, grackles, jays, crows, kingbirds, and chickadees, among others, engage in mobbing. They may do this alone or in a group, and with birds of the same species or a different species may join forces. It can happen any time of the year, but is especially common during the breeding season. They are usually after raptors like owls and hawks, but also cranes, herons, and pelicans. There are two basic purposes of mobbing, to protect themselves and to protect their nests. I once heard this quote, nothing brings two people, or birds in this case, closer together than their mutual animosity toward a third. Mobbing is a time when birds of different species put aside any differences they have and join forces against a mutual threat. Interestingly, crows may join in with blue jays to mob a perched great horned owl, when other times, the blue jays will mob crows, especially if they have a nest nearby. Whatever the situation, the goal is to shine a floodlight on the intruder and let everyone know, hey, over here, there's a predator. By blowing their cover, they hope to drive the antagonist away. In fact, this is sometimes a good method for finding owls or other birds of prey. Just listen to the birds and they'll tell you. In all of these images of mobbing birds, you may have noticed that the bird doing the mobbing is behind the target or above its head or wings it is always safely away from sharp beaks and talons. But you may be wondering, why does the bigger bird just put up with it? Harm is rarely done to the target bird, but why don't they fight back? Well, from the perspective of a cost-benefit analysis, it's really not worth it. Smaller birds are much more agile and quick than large birds with large wings, making it difficult to be captured. Defending themselves or catching the other bird would require more energy than it's worth, so they usually just put up with it for a little while and then take off to a new area. Have you ever seen a bird being mobbed? If so, what bird was being pursued and by which species? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you for watching. That's all for this time. I'll see you again soon.